Hi guys, today we're going to install crossbars from Bush RV in 2018 uh, Toyota RAV4. I'll show you what comes in the set. Well, obviously we have two crossbars. Uh, we have the Allen tool and the manual. And this is all that we need. The installation will be very simple. The longer piece goes to the front of the vehicle and the shorter goes to the back. Uh, the round edge always has to face the front of the vehicle. This makes it more aerodynamic. And uh, both pieces are labeled. This is for the rear installation and uh, the front one. Uh, right now I'll show you how it works. So we have this clamp here which uh, will go onto the rail so first what we have to do is basically simply unscrew this screw using the tool that comes with the set don't unscrew it all the way uh, just until it's enough to turn the lower clamp so this side is ready for the installation you have to do the same thing on the other side Also, uh, there are two screws on this side which will allow you to adjust the length of the crossbar but don't forget to tighten these uh, screws after you do the installation. Let's install the first piece. You have to first rest it on top of the rail. Uh, the crossbar has to be approximately six inches away from this line uh, that ends the base of the rail. So somewhere like this on both sides. After that you simply have to turn this bracket, lower bracket, and now using the same tool Allen tool you can tighten these two screws. The torque for these screws is around 30 to 35 inches per pound, uh, which is actually pretty small torque. So you can easily do it by hand, but the trick is not to over tighten these screws. Same on this side. Remember I said you can adjust the length, so if it's not properly secure, you can kind of push it in. And now we can tighten this side. Don't forget to tighten uh, these two screws underneath after you're done with the top ones. The torque for these ones is uh, 6 Newton meters, which is again is not too much, so it means do not over tighten these screws as well because you can break them and here is the front piece the idea is exactly the same uh, the round side of the crossbar faces the front we are six inches away from this line roughly like this on both sides and uh, now I will tighten both screws
torque is the same 30 to 35 inches per pound for the upper screws And the same idea for the bottom ones. The torque is uh, 6 Newton meters. Also, you have to check lower screws on the other side as well. Even though they are not adjustable, they are still present. And uh, it's best to make sure that they are secure as well. installation is complete maximum weight limit for the crossbars is 70 kilograms or 154 pounds uh, one more time I'll show you how they look I'm quite pleased with the result I think it's a great alternative for OEM crossbars and as you can see, uh, installation was very simple. Anybody can do it in about 10 minutes. Also, um, another good point is to recheck uh, the torque, the screws, every about 1,000 kilometers. This way you will make sure that your crossbars are secure. Thank you guys for watching. I'll leave the link for this product in the description.